I think of it as a, a room where I get to use light as the animating force. If we're all sort of in transition, being on common ground while that's happening gives you something in common with the person that you're sharing the experience with. It's all hand cut. And I feel like the hand cutness of it is what gives it also part of the dynamism. So I like the idea of giving into what I think is my graphic impulse and making a decision, putting the knife down, cutting and going, okay, got to keep going. One cut stands for a million cross hatches. The walls are, they're Tyvek. Tyvek is a building material. It's used as a layer inside of the building so that it's a moisture barrier between the siding and the insulation. So it has this sense of, of lightness, but it's also very tough. So with the window that I've done here, the, the specific thing about doing it here for the Arthur Ross is this is the first time I've had natural light as part of the lighting in my transition room. And so I decided to do a treatment for the window that reflected the shapes that I saw in the window and hang it out in front so that the window was sort of like a backdrop for how I recreated the windows in paper. And um, so it's also a place to be held in beauty and held in the spirit of whatever my good, I think of my good intention and to make of it what you want. I always try to start with a little thing and let whoever comes in add to the meaning of my intention. I've talked about the fact that one of the things I have done in my portraits, and there are many people doing portraits out there, and there's no shortage of portraits to commemorate, portraits to, you know, talk about history and certain kinds of ways, history that perhaps has not been talked about. But for me, it's about thinking about um, the people who are around me who in my way of viewing them, they are also mythic. You know, people after, you know, any long time, whether it's Frederick Douglass or Langston Hughes, they become mythic. The truth be told, that is what we're all living for and looking toward in the other is that thing that we do in the world that distinguishes us, that references the bigger than who we are.